Hello everyone, welcome to day 23 of the May Painting Challenge. Um, as you can see I've got, doesn't look like much, but I went around all the edges where I dry brushed the armor, cleaned it up so it's ready to be painted. I found his arms, there's his guns, put the talons on. In his head. There we go. So he's looking more like a warrior now. We have the Swarm Lord. All those little bits and pieces there where his arms are. Around all the armor everywhere. Just takes a little while to clean up. But he's done as well. Um, the Turvagon cleaned up as well. The little guys. So he's ready. And same with his head. And his arms. Setting talents. Um, then we have this guy who I glued together and cleaned up a bit. He was in kind of rough shape being glued. He uh, did not want to go back together. And then we have this guy. See if the light will be nice. His skin's done. All I have left on him are the gun right here, the black part. I paint it differently than I paint the skin in poison. Put these up so you can kind of see little scything talons um, and I still have to do his poison so he's almost done just not quite so on to today's question um, leave this guy out front so today's question is that guy you all know him love or hate him um, my actual written down that guy I didn't put an answer because I wasn't sure um, if I was going to say it or not, or what I was going to say. Um, but I do have that guy's story. Um, a friend of mine, um, now this isn't the guy, that guy, he's just a friend that plays, um, Is was pretty new to the game, started off with orcs, didn't really go so well as he thought, so we switched over to Grey Knights, and we were having a game in a league, and... Um, Another guy, who is that guy, um, no one would really play with him, so he didn't really know the rules or anything, he just kind of followed some of the storyline, and that's what his models could do. So each of his basic infantry shot plasma bolt cannon things, and it was pretty crazy. Uh, every game we played, because I was the only one that would have a game with him, um, I had to teach him, you know, you have to move this much, shoot this much, you need this to hit, you need this to wound. Uh, I basically had to teach him every part of the game every time we played. So most people got frustrated and couldn't last a couple turns so they didn't bother. But we were playing, it was a lot of fun. Um, sadly, for some r odd reason, I always rolled amazing against him. Like my Trevagon, I played in the league, first game I got four models. Second game, I got six models and spawned out, couldn't spawn anymore. Those of you who don't know, uh, these guys produce three D6 of these little guys. Um, and if you roll doubles, you can't do it anymore. Um, against this guy, I rolled, I think I summoned 59 of them in one game. And I didn't even roll doubles, I just stopped because it wasn't fair. Uh, we rock, paper, scissors to see if I had an assault phase. Uh, because he didn't want to get uh, in hand-to-hand -hand with my Tyranids, so... And he won, so I did an assault. So, there was a whole bunch of that going on. I let him set up the table, everything. It just didn't seem to matter. My rolling just... Epic. It wasn't even fair. Could have saved that for a tournament or something. But, um... Getting on to the that guy story. Um, I was playing against my other friend, who was playing Grey Knights at the time. And he walked in up to our table and looked at his army, looked at him, 
and with the straight face just said, you do not stand a chance. And my friend and I, like, he was like, what? And I just burst out laughing. He's like, you can't beat him if you had more models. And he just started talking trash to him. It was hilarious. It wasn't meant to be, like, insulting. It was just kind of how he reacted to things. And just the look on my friend's face when he heard that he didn't stand a chance because he had less models than me. It was just so funny. Um, so that's more or less the that guy story. Um, yeah, it was just so funny. Um, but I did end up winning. Um, it was really, really close though. Uh, Grey Knights versus Tyranids. Grey Knights are point heavy. They're, like, their cheapest model in their codex was like 25 points. Um, my cheapest point was like five, so, and I ran a swarm list, I had 40 gargoyles, 30 termagants, 20 hormagons, um, yeah, just a lot of model, I had 103 models, and my opponent had like 30, if that, and yeah, so, and force weapons on all the Grey Knights, not good against Tyranids, just kills them instantly, um, but, so yeah, that was my that guy story. Uh, I don't think he's playing anymore, uh, which is kind of a shame. Um, even though he didn't know the rules or how to play, he was a fun guy to hang out with. But Alright, so that's it for day 23, and see you tomorrow.